Welcome, fellow fans of Clash of Clans. It is your host, Galadon. I don't know why I said it that way. But anyway, welcome to the video. Thank you so much for stopping by. Yes, it's true. The Diamond Pass is technically already here in Clash of Clans. And it should not be a surprise because the Diamond Pass, in some way, shape, or form, exists in every Supercell game that is active and global right now. So we really have to take a look at the bigger picture because as much as Supercell is filled with employees who love to play and make games that people love, well, th those, those employees have to get paid in order to be able to do that, right? So there's this balance. And the question is, are we at the right balance? And I'm not talking about offense, defense. I'm talking about monetization balance more so right now than ever before there seems to be this controversy this discussion about well clash of clans just going a little bit too far now there isn't really an argument in other games because it's pretty much a foregone conclusion that clash royale has gone way too far and the other games well you just don't hear the complaints that you do in royale or now in clash of clans personally i'm okay with where the monetization stands in Clash. I think it's a good balance between free to play and pay to progress faster. Now, however, if we look at Clash Royale, oh man, it's literally hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars of offers that are on their offers page every single day. And I'm not talking about gems that are for sale. I'm talking about the idea that you can buy all of these different packages that help advance different cards or evolutions or elite levels. And I, I, I'm completely confused and I play this game every day, but there it is. The actual for real diamond pass is in Clash Royale. It is $11.99. In Brawl Stars, there is a Brawl Pass Plus for $9.99. So we can start to see the similarities. Add up the gold pass in Clash plus the event pass and you're going to end up with an amount similar to the Diamond Pass in Clash, the Brawl Pass in Brawl Stars, or if we look at other Supercell games, we're really going to begin to see a pattern here. And that's where I don't think anybody should be surprised at Clash of Clans adding an event every single month, which is what Fernando Ferry, the Clash of Clans community manager, said was probably going to happen. Look at Boom Beach. Yep, that, that's Galadon's account in Boom Beach. There is a Boom Pass. Now the Boom Pass, slightly more expensive than the Clash Gold Pass, $7.99. But also, that's right, there are other little add-ons like the Extra Builder that only lasts for a month or Instant Training for a month. You could spend even more than Clash of Clans per month on those passes. So far, that puts Clash of Clans in third place behind Clash Royale and Boom Beach. Now off to Heyday, the peaceful, relaxing, beautiful Heyday. Well, of course, it also offers a farm pass for only a bargain basement price of $4.99. But wait, there's more. You could buy the farm pass bundle and spend a full $11.99. And then there's all these additional add-ons which actually take it way past the monetization level in Clash of Clans, unless you consider the packages, but those are only every few days. All right, so Clash really not that extreme when it comes to the monetization level. Now, I would suggest if you're going to buy stuff in Heyday, go ahead and use creator code Phoebe. She's my favorite. I love her videos and her live streams, and um, that's about it. So, hey, the moral of the story is don't complain that much about Clash of Clans because it's only in the middle of the road amongst all Supercell games. Now, don't get me started on epic hero equipment, right? Okay, thank you, Galafam, for sticking around all the way to the end of the episode. You know you are the true hashtag Galafam. That is why I love, think about, and appreciate every single one of you every single day. So get out there, make the best of the rest of your day, week, month, and be kind to other people, animals, on the planet. I'll see you all back here again tomorrow for more full attacks. So you're saying Clash of Clans is actually cheap?